Hi, Libra. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Okay. Hang on, guys. I'm trying to fix this uh, mic. Okay. Nope, that's not it. All right, thank you, God, for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what's going on for my Libras. Let's see. Okay. Now we have for Libra. We have for Libra. Okay, Libra, the tower. All of a sudden. Hmm. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. Or you like having some transformative type of energy change. Like it could be arguments. It could be a natural disaster where you are. Let's see. The five of swords. This definitely could be some arguments. Maybe with an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius coming up first, Deacon Aquarius. So early January, the Hermit card. And then you kind of shut this person out. Or it's like you're giving this person the cold shoulder. Or all of a sudden you, you have rough conversation with this person. Or you tell them like it is. Or you don't want to play mind games. Or they feel like you're playing mind games. Or I don't know if you go ghost on this person or you ghost this person. Let's see. The Knight of Wands. It's like you leave. You leave or the other person leaves. The Six of Pentacles. It's maybe like you journey on it and you try to find something else or you try to travel somewhere else. It's like you're trying to move away from this with the Six of Pentacles. It's like you're giving, you have been breadcrumbing this person or vice versa. They have been breadcrumbing you, not giving enough or giving just enough. Or you were giving them just enough attention. Two of pentacles. You were hoping that something changed between the two of you. You were waiting for it, but I don't think it will or it is. This just reads as if, as if somebody is just not interested in a particular person anymore. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. This could be somebody from your recent past. The Three of Wands. This person was really trying to make you like fall in love with them. It could be we've got Scorpio and Aquarius coming up. Um, they're waiting for your call. They're waiting for some answer. They want the truth of the matter. They don't want you to kind of mince words with them. They want you to be honest about what it is you have to say. This person could be in love with you, especially if this is a man to a woman. It's like they're they're telling you the truth. Four wands. It's like they want to take you somewhere, take you out, parade you around, move in with you. Six of wands and the star card. It's like yeah, this person wants. It's like they see something in you. Or they see something you know forever with you, or they want to come towards you or you're the number one person in their life or they look up to you oh they look up to you they feel like you're smart you got it going on they look up to you they may want attention from you or they want to like promote the relationship nine of cups yeah they want if you guys are separated they definitely want to see you what's the advice here for libra the emperor okay so it's saying stand your ground stay firm in what you believe um be unmovable um let's see the King of Pentacles, okay, and the Two of Cups. So you may have two different people after you on uh, Libra. Um, it could be someone, the child's father, something about a father or an older gentleman. Um, the Seven of Wands, you kind of hold somebody at bay, 
Like you don't want them. You don't want what they're offering. The moon card. Could be lying to yourself. Or just not being honest. Or the both of you could be lying to yourself about what the relationship is. Or what it really means to you. The lovers and the ten of swords. This could be a high level soulmate, but somebody's not up for it for whatever reason. Somebody's not taking to it or somebody's done with it. Or there's just not a lot of enough attraction here for uh, the relationship to be maintained. Um, you or this other person could have left or they, yeah, they left the relationship. Or somebody didn't choose the soulmate journey and it's going to cause them a lot of grief. With the Ten of Swords, somebody just can't cope with the fact that it's over, it's done, that somebody walked away or somebody closed the door or someone put up the blinders or um, or the blockers. They just don't want to be bothered. They're standing on their square. Um, it could be you. It could be the other person. It could be the both of you. I don't know, both of you could be in your ego. This could be same sex too. It's just like, you know, I'm not having it. I don't want it. Some of you really closed out this cycle when you're looking for something else and the cards are saying that you're ready. And it's a no. It's a definite it's not a definite no because it doesn't have the exclamation point. But it's a no. Um what else do we have for Libra? Look for a sign. Okay, so if you don't know which way to go, if you don't know if this is the right thing to do, look for a sign. Um if you don't know if this is something that you can deal with, yeah, recovery. Some of you, somebody needs to go to recovery. This could be drug, alcohol related too, or this could be someone's health or someone is losing everything or they lost everything and they're losing people in their life. They could be going through that right now. And then this card also talks about some people who have already gone through that and they're they are they are on the uh, tail end or, of recovery. Like they're coming out of this. So, or somebody could be coming out of recovery, a recovery house or something of that nature. Um, somebody needs to be honest about their sexuality too. We get two, two basically two men coming up here. It's just not enough tra attraction to hold something together. Somebody's over it. Like, you know, I, I try, but I can't. Okay, I can't any longer. I can't stay in this any longer. This is what I have for you, Libra. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. 9 30 p.m eastern standard time thank you libra many blessings to you take care